Today, I've got a bit of a challenge for you. I'd like you to name the seven natural wonders of the world. I'll give you 10 seconds. Get thinking, get thinking, anything up there? Mm, think big, think wide, think deep. What have you come up with? Number one, the tallest mountain on earth. Of course, the great and mighty Mount Everest. Number two, Victoria Falls, the mighty Zambezi River, crashes between the countries of Zimbabwe and Zambia. Number three, the Grand Canyon, 442 kilometers long, 29 kilometers wide, and 1,500 meters deep. Number four, the harbor at Rio de Janeiro. Number five is the Northern Lights. They occur at between three and six degrees of latitude and are caused by cosmic particles entering our atmosphere. Number six, is the Paracutin volcano in Mexico. To be honest, I've no idea why it's there, but it did appear in just over one year from a flat farmer's field and ended up at 424 meters high. Very interesting. And of course, number seven, which I love and you should get, the Great Barrier Reef. 2,300 kilometers long, made up of 2,900 individual reefs and running all the way up the Queensland coast. But what human beings have taken for granted for years could change on November the 11th as voting closes for the new Seven Wonders of the World. The list has been whittled down to 28 finalists and of course the Great Barrier Reef is one of them. But we can't take it for granted it'll stay that way. Now I need to be on location. Take me to the Great Barrier Reef. That's better. Well today you find me in the middle of the Coral Sea on Vlasov Cay. We are halfway up the Great Barrier Reef and to prove that every single vote counts we've set up what could be the most remote polling station in the world. There are so many reasons to vote for the Great Barrier Reef but you need just one. Whether you've been here yourself seen it on TV or just dreamt about it. One of the most amazing places on the planet. And uh, to, give you, to, give you some, to give you some numbers about it, it's more than 2,300 kilometers long. You can see it from space. Well, the Great Barrier Reef definitely deserves to be one of the seven wonders. It's, um, it's one of the things you learn about at school. It's, no matter where you're from in the world, you learn about it as a kid, the Great Barrier Reef Australia. I've been going out there since I was five years old. I'm 63 now. I've done well over 5,000 trips out there and I still find it fantastic every day I go out there. Visit www.new7wonders.com and cast your vote now. And remember, it's not called the Great Barrier Reef for nothing. <laughs>